What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Aquarius, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is um, the Gist of 96 for the sign of Aquarius. This can resonate if you have Aquarius in any aspects of your chart, sun, moon, rising, Venus, or sun, moon, haven, your charts. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it does not fly, it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you and leave the rest. Uh, free general reading for a sign of Aquarius. One message may apply. Two may apply. Two plus may apply. None may apply. Only you know your story, not anybody else. This is a free general collective reading, so you have to plug it in your own personal situation in life. However, it resonates. If it does uh, resonate for you, Aquarius, um, just saying, just saying. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. We're at 12,735 subscribers right now. So thanks so much for all the love and support for the channel. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess Grow 5. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash app, no Venmo, if you feel guided to donate. Okay, so I received two channel messages, messages in as I was meditating on your energy for this just in 96. The first one, I heard, wait for it, and I heard, heard it kind of big. Wait for it. So... Energies can be reversed, so maybe you're what I feel. Maybe for a lot of you guys, it's for you because this is your gist in '96. I feel wait, wait for it. Like something big is about to happen in some shape, form, or fashion. So wait for it. For some, it could be somebody you're connected to, but I'm feeling for a majority of you guys, it's you. So like, wait for it, energy. Like something big is about to happen. Just kind of watch and wait. Kind of energy is what I'm feeling for some. Um, for some, it could be somebody else. Um, and the second one, oh crap, I forgot the second one. Hold on a second. I forgot the second one. Give me a second. I forgot it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. A significant donation coming soon is what I heard. Yeah. A significant donation coming soon. So, um, I feel for a lot of you guys, a significant donation coming soon is to you because it's your gist in 96. But for some of you guys, it could be energies can be reversed and you could be giving a significant donation to person, people, place, family, or situation. Um, or it could be both. You receiving a donation and you giving a donation. However, that resonates and applies in one's life, Aquarius. Knight of Wands reversed. Queen of Cups reversed. Four of Pentacles reversed. Five of Cups upright, Knight of Swords reversed, the Sun upright. A particular married couple you know is spending money like water. Spending money like water. For some, it is your friends, and you're you're they're gonna ask you advice soon. You're going to give it to them, but they're not going to like it. Financial advice. Free financial advice. Oh my lord. So you plug it in how it resonates. <laughs> I find this kind of funny, to be honest with you, because I heard they're not going to like the advice, and I heard it's going to be free financial advice, but they're not going to like it. But the thing is, is they asked for it. They asked for the advice, man. So you plug it in how it resonates. Uh, whoever you are, I think you're good with money. I think you're good with money. You're good with finances. You're good with assets. You're good with... Um, you're good with finances, I feel, whoever this is for, because there's a reason they're asking you for advice. Um, I heard they're not going to like it. It's a married couple that um, that you know in some shape, form, or fashion. I feel this is your married couple. For some, it could be a fire sign or a water sign married couple, or they could have fire or um, water or highly aspected in their charts. Aries, Leo, Sag, um, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. Um, I feel for a lot of you guys, it's a heterosexual couple, a masculine and a feminine, because they're pulling up energetically as a masculine and a feminine energy with married couple energy. Um, but only you know you're showing out anybody else. For some, it could be a homosexual married couple, uh, fems or masculines. 
but I'm feeling for a good majority of you guys, <clears throat> it's a masculine and feminine heterosexual couple uh, with fire or uh, and water highly aspected in their charts in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, but you plug it in how it resonates. It doesn't necessarily have to be a fire sign, water sign couple. Um, but this is their overspending. I mean, they are spending till the cows come home. But they're about to ask you for financial advice. I heard they're not going to like it. But you're going to be straight up with them. You're going to be straight up with them and, and tell them. Uh, it sounds like you're going to give them good, sound, honest advice. But they're not going to like it. So you plug it in how it resonates, if that resonates for you. Five of Cups upright, Knight of Swords reversed, the Sun upright. An Aquarius is about to learn of some serious dark truths. Serious dark truths. Some on a Gemini. Some on another Aquarius, some on a Libra, some on a Capricorn, some on a Pisces. It's about to make you very, very, very regretful of the past. However, you're about to take this information and run with it. Deliver it to important people. Okay, so you plug it in, how it resonates. So some serious dark truth energy of the past sounds like about to come out to you, Aquarius, if this resonates for you, if that message applies. Um, some it's on a, another Aquarius, some it's on a Gemini, some it's on a Libra, some on a Pisces, some on a, uh, who was the other one? There was another one. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Pisces, and there was another one. Some on a Leo, some on a Leo, but there was another one too. There was another one too. Um, I heard you're about to take the information and you're about to run with it. So you're about to take this information. You're about to run with it. I heard it's going to make you very, very regretful of the past. Um, whoever the other sign is, you'll have to go back and check it if you're, if that message applies for you. Um, it's a lot of signs there though. Uh, so I feel for some of you guys, it's a lot of people. Um, but, um, but you only, you know, you're starting out anybody else. One, it might be one person. For some of you guys, you're about to learn the serious start truths on. For some, it could be two or two plus. I did, I uh, for sure remember Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Pisces, Leo. There was another sign too. You'll have to go back and check it. But however that applies, um, I heard you're going to take the information you're going to run with it. You're going to run with it. So this is your regretful energy of the past. Five of Cups upright. I think you used to hang around with these people or associate with these people like in a, um, in a, um, like a social kind of way. Um, I absolutely freaking literally do, but, um, but you're regretful now. You're regretful and, um, you're about to deliver the information. Um, dark truths coming out. It's something dark on these people. I'll tell you that whatever the hell it is, it's something dark, um, whoever these people are and how they apply. For some, it's a Taurus. For some, it's a Taurus. Okay, so Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Pisces, um, Leo, and Taurus. I mean, we, and another sign, whoever the other one is, I forget. Um, yikes, but it's going to make you happy to deliver it. So I heard you're going to deliver it to uh, important people. Um, I, it's some kind of dark truth. So, I mean, hell, it's something really dark they're either into for some, they could be into dark arts, possibly. I didn't hear they were. Or they could, it could be criminal activity. I'm feeling it's either a criminal activity or dark arts, which dark arts can lead to criminal activity with the sacrificial energy and all that shit. And I'm just being for real. Um, if they go that to that great lengths to sacrifice somebody as a blood sacrifice. And I'm being, I'm being serious. Um, but it's going to make you happy to deliver it. So, um... For some, it could be COVID energy, possibly. For some, it could be COVID energy. Um, I didn't hear it was, but it possibly could be. But it's going to make you very, very happy. For some, you could be dealing with the Leo, because you have Leo energy. If you are, they could have Leo in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Moon, Human, and Jupiter charts, if you are. Um, but, ooh, let me see if I hear anything else. And an Aquarius that's about to realize they have been stolen from in a huge way. 
is about to pay it forward to the person that opened their eyes to the theft. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Well, that's a good one, Aquarius. So if this resonates for you, um, um, you're about to be realized you have been stolen from in a huge way. So some kind of theft energy, but somebody has opened your eyes to the fact that you have been stolen from. If this resonates for you, and I heard, um, it sounds like soon you're about to pay it forward to this person. You're about to pay the pay it forward to the person that helped you open your eyes to the fact that you have been stolen from. Um, I think they gave you some kind of information um, to open your eyes to the fact that you are being stolen from. And it caused you to check into it and you realize, oh yeah, I'm being so stole from. And so it's helped you, obviously, or is about to help you. And you're about to pay it forward to that person. That's what I'm feeling, but only you know you're showing out anybody else. All right, you guys, I love you guys so much. Namaste.